one enemy on the field. You can do it! Here goes! It's not going down! One enemy to go! Keep it up! Go forth! So persistent! Enemy down! We can smash them all! Let's do it! It's my turn! Bring it on! Here goes Persona! Play down and die already! Here goes! Damn, it's not going down! I am now. There! So persistent! Persona! Now's our chance! You ready? Wait, what? Okay! Oh, Senpai, that was perfect! Here goes! Crush it time! Lay down and die already! It got back up! Defeat it fast! Yukiko Senpai, wake up, please! Yukiko oh, Senpai, someone heal him! Enemy down. No, we ain't doing it. Do some more damage. 
damage. Here it goes. Crush it time. It ain't going down. <gasps> it got back up. Defeat it fast. <gasps> you okay there, Kanji? Don't strain yourself. I am thou. There! <laughs> Last one! Go for it! Let's do this! Persona! Let's see thick skin! Persona! Yes. Enemy down! We can smash them all! Let's do it! It's my turn! Bring it on! Goes Persona! It ain't going down! I am thou. There! Here goes! That's some thick skin! Persona! Thank you. 
Senpai. Yeah!
Sheesh.
over. <sighs> I'm so sleepy. Yuck! Don't yawn in my face like that. Ugh. Hey, for the third question on the English test, which phrase did you choose? Um, oh, I went with used to. <sighs> so much for Chie going abroad. Heck, why leave Inaba? You have so much right here. You're so annoying! Yo. No more encores. I mean, hi everyone. Whoa, more losers? What do I need to know English for? I can always ask for a translator. How did you do, Senpai? Whoa, are you that confident? Wait, confident about what? Enough about the exams already. What's going on with the murder case? Hmm. Why don't we head to our special headquarters? We have been. Uh, I'm kind of bummed. Not just because exams are over, but the whole thing with the police finding a suspect. I mean, we believe that only we could solve this case. And now? Well, we still don't know yet. They haven't made an arrest. So, we gotta sit on our thumbs. For crying out loud, it's nice to have a suspect, but where the hell is he? We're at the end of our rope here. You guys, did, did you hear what I said? Uh, <laughs> this case is as good as solved. Don't worry, kids. It's only a matter of time before we bring in the suspect. I mean... The guy's kidnapping people at random and slaughtering them. We won't rest until we bring him to justice. I gotta get going. Now, I'm really worried. On the other hand, if the police have a search warrant out for the guy, we should stay out of it. Yeah. Oh, uh, I just remembered. There was a question on the exam that I didn't get. I think it was the chemical formula HCHO, used for silver mirror reactions. Its 40% solution is known as formalin. And the question was, what is HCHO? I chose acidic acid. Duh, of course it couldn't have been vinegar. Hey, you had that question too, didn't you, Con? Shut up. Don't call me by my first name. Wow, kind of harsh, aren't you? I heard you got a nosebleed when you were around our senpai. Hey, who the hell blabbed about that? Uh, anyway, Risa-chan, why don't you ask Yukiko to help you study? Hmm? I guess, but wouldn't you rather ask a senpai of the opposite sex? Senpai, I'm not a nuisance to you, am I? Damn, this girl's dangerous. Well, let's change the subject. Hey, any idea how Teddy's doing? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention it to you. Check this out. I let him stay at my place. In return, He's now our official store mascot. Ah, so he's hiding in plain sight. Reverse psychology, huh? Man, he looks like one happy bear. He kept saying that he didn't want to go back, so I made him a deal. Now, since I've got nothing better to do, I'm gonna go bug him. Ooh, I wanna go too! Can I... feel his soft fur? Hey, senpai? Now that I'm getting the hang of school, I want to go out more and see the sights. 
but I tend to get recognized everywhere I go, so I'm a little nervous about going out on my own. And you seem like the type of guy who knows all the cool spots in town. <laughs> Kill, think of me, okay? Now come on, let's go pester Teddy! Hey! Tonight, we have a special report. The topic is the bizarre serial murder case in Inaba, where the victim's bodies are discovered hanging up... Police have yet to announce any progress in the investigation since the discovery of a third victim. Our special report tonight is a summary of the events and the facts in the case thus far. They still haven't caught him? Yeah. Dad's working hard too.
Sensei!
Hmm.
I see. Um... Hey, why don't we go somewhere during summer vacation? My motorcycle's back from the shop. Hey, you guys have motorcycles? Lucky you. Your scooter's fixed? I'm surprised they got it back together after Hanako Senpai, was it? Did something happen with Yosuke and Hanako san? He's striking out with the ladies and got his scooter busted up. Yosuke's after Hanako-san? Uh, I'll back you up. I wasn't talking about anything like that. I was saying we should go somewhere over summer vacation, like the beach. 
It'd be a pain to go by train, but a mo- Hmm, I haven't been to the beach in a long time either. The bright sun, the glistening waves, that luscious scent drifting from nearby stands, the dripping of meat juices. Is food all you can think about? Hey, why don't we get our licenses too? It's just a written text. We can't, we're too young. Oh, sorry, Kanji, but my birthday was last month, so I'm 16 now. Hey, that's cheating! Oh, but sitting behind Senpai sounds great too. I want to squeeze in close. Yeah, yeah, let me remind you that it's against the law to have two people ride on a motorcycle. But I think it's a good idea for you guys to get your licenses. It only takes about a week. It's supposed to be for work, but there's a scooter at the inn. We got one as a gift at the office that's just sitting around. I bet I could borrow it if I asked. I'd have to call my manager, though. Huh. Is this actually working out? How about you, Chie? A scooter, huh? It can be any kind, as long as it's lower than 50 cc's. Then I might be in luck. One of our relatives loves motorcycles. Maybe he has a scooter I can borrow. Whoa, this might really happen. Let's all get our licenses and hit the beach together. Hold up, what about Teddy? Hmm, if he doesn't move around, he could pass his luggage. That's eh, stretching a little. It'll be fine. If we can't get him on with one of us, we'll just strap on some wheels and tow him. What's so funny? Teddy? <laughs> On wheels? <laughs> Roller skates? <laughs> it's perfect! I've made up my mind. I'm gonna get my license. The beach, huh? I've gone before for pinup shoots, but it's been a while since I went for fun. Oh my gosh. Does this mean... I'll get to see Reset herself in a swimsuit with my own two eyes? Can you maybe not talk about her like she's not here? Hey, who are you looking forward to seeing in a swimsuit, Senpai? I shouldn't expect too much. I think I'll choose a swimsuit for myself next year. Anyway, looks like we're set on going to the beach. Yukiko, Chie, you guys should get your licenses too. Then you can... Well then, let's do this! Yeah! Huh? Oh, yeah!
Yeah. Hey man. I really did like you back then.
What? I see. Thank you. Bye then.
Well, we better get some rest. Okay, Risa and Teddy are checking out the other side, so we'll go ahead and start the meeting. Now about what happened last night, you guys all saw it, right? Yeah, shit he said made my blood boil. That mumbling of his and those fish-like eyes pissed me off even more. Who the hell is he? normal circumstances, I'd agree. But when I noticed how clear the image was on TV, I knew something was different. So I called Chie, and while we were talking, it hit me. Maybe that boy is the culprit. It's just a hunch, but it makes sense. We've been told the suspect is a high schooler. The police are after him for the murder of King Moron. So to see that on TV last night, at a time like this? I mean, he even taunted the viewers, saying, try and catch me. Uh, so? All right, let's say there's this high school student. We'll call him Shin. For some random reason, who knows why, Shin is able to enter the other world. Then Shin, again for some random reason, starts throwing people into that world intending to kill them. Police can't prove the other world exists, so it's the perfect crime. He can't possibly be caught. Now, imagine you're Shin, but after a while, people stop dying when you throw them in the TV. You don't know why. You want to kill King Moron, but the TV is out, so you have to do it personally. Now the police are on to you. As a result, you, I mean Shin, is a wanted criminal and there's no place for him to run. So, you're saying he went into the other world to dodge the cops? Oh, so that's why he said, catch me if you can. <laughs> wow, senpai, you're smarter than you look. Jeez, you can piss me off sometimes. We still don't know why he targeted people who were shown on TV. But if he had a personal grudge against Mr. Moraoka, that explains one thing. With a strong enough motive, wouldn't he forsake the untraceable TV method and try to kill Mr. Moraoka on his own? If you think about it that way, it sort of makes sense why Mr. Moraoka died without appearing on... But I wonder what that boy's going to do now that he's in there. With Teddy on this side, there's no way for him to get out. You don't think he's gonna get desperate and end it all? He did look depressed, like it was the end of the world. No, I don't think that's it. The killer has to know that the people he threw into the TV have come back to this side. I can see missing Yukiko or Kanji, but Risei, a celebrity? There's no way the killer wouldn't know she's still alive. So that means he knows there's a way out of the TV world. As for the rest, we'll just have to ask him face to face. Hey, good timing. How did it go? Not good. There's not enough information to go on. But at least we're positive that someone's in there. I see. Wait, where's Teddy? He's still looking. All right. So we need to find out who that guy is, and if he is in fact the one the police are after. Once we figure that out, 
We just do our thing. That's right. If he really is the killer and he's escaped into the other world, the police don't have a chance of catching him. So it's all on us. Well then, let's get digging.
Okay, is everyone...
Eternal midnight. For mornings when I can't see you. Spicy mint tea. For brunch, a marmalade muffin. A touch of bitter fits my mood. A sigh is stardust. It's like our own Milky Way. I can't catch up to your distant back. Look! Twilight creeps up on us. The distance to you is like an eternal night. What is this? Everyone's here. Yeah. That's him, all right. It's definitely the guy on the Midnight Channel. It's settled then. He is the killer. And he's in here now. This guy came to our shop before. Was he spying on me? Oh my god, I really was being targeted. Damn it! Freaking punk! Hey, I've seen him before too! Oh, now I remember! Yukiko, it's that one guy! That one guy? Back in April, remember? He suddenly came and started hitting on you? Oh, him! The dude who got served by Yukiko in front of the school! Man, Chie, how'd you remember something like that? Well, that was the first time he talked to her, but I remember! He was always following her around! Um, sorry, who are we talking about? The dude who came right up to you at the school gates and called you Yuki? Oh... Uh, really? Wait, did he kidnap Yukiko to get back at her for rejecting him? Um, I didn't really reject him. He came up to me while I was busy working and asked, Don't the biker gangs bother you? Just going on and on about how biker gangs can't do anything unless they're in a pack and stuff. He seemed to be the type who just keeps talking whether you like it or not. I usually treat those people politely so they don't get offended, but I was so tired that I kind of ignored him. Was that why I was kidnapped? Huh? Wait, I I'm not a biker. Ugh, a damn special report. So that's why I got dragged into this. You know, I heard he's been saying stuff about that announcer's affair, too. Lots of muttering about how women who cheat on their husbands should be executed. Sounds like it's all coming together. Well, it's time for a showdown. Can you tell where this Mitsuo guy's at? I'll give it a try. Just a sec. Yeah, I found him. He's that way. We're so close to the killer. We can't lose him now. What is this? Some kind of game? Well, he did taunt us. 
saying try and catch me. I guess he thinks of all this as a game. Oh, this pisses me off! I hereby sentence him to a hundred kicks to the face! Gotta admit, all guys love... And all girls love Teddy. Chance. All right. It's showtime. Are you ready? You guys better keep up. Yeah, go, go, go.
two enemies. Go You're doing well! Yeah. There are two enemies. Careful now. Go for it, guys. Hang in there. Whoa, Kanji, that was great. on the field. Be careful. Let's do this. Someone else's turn. Go for it. I can't defeat three it. of them. Don't give up now, okay? Here goes. Persona! Yukiko-senpai, are you okay? Yukiko-senpai, wake up, please! Oh, nice move, Yusuke-senpai! Can you stand? Let's do this! Persona! Okay, let's go! Go get him! Go, go, go! One more on the enemy side. Hang in there. Enemy down! Ah, Dan! everyone! And action! Do this in style. Go!
but you have the advantage. Enemy <laughs> down. Nice well move, done. Senpai. <laughs>
Enemies on the field. <laughs> That's amazing!
advantage. I am thou. I couldn't do it. Here goes Persona! Damn, couldn't finish. Two enemies left. Don't lower your guard now. Here goes. Senpai can't get back up! <laughs> <laughs> 
Somebody get away! Persona! Let's do this! Persona! Someone else's turn! Last one! Go for it! I couldn't do it! Here goes! Persona! It ain't going down!
Let's do this. Ah! Damn, it's not going down. Just two left. Come yeah. on, this fight's not over. Here goes. Crush it time. Someone else's turn. Yukiko Senpai is poisoned. Don't let 
gotta get away. Thick skin. Whoa, Kanji, that was great! 
That's amazing, Yukiko-senpai. Keep it up. Yosuke-senpai! Man, oh man! I am now! Yukiko-senpai beats the enemy in style! Don't give up now, okay? Here goes Persona! I wasn't expecting that from you, Kanji. Kanji, sweet. Kanji, that was great. I'm You're the man. Now. Whoa, Kanji, that was great. What the hell are you looking at? Oh, congratulations! Another level! Gotta keep at it! to fight me.
Home.